Welcome. Today, we'll show you how to set up your Rogers Xfinity Gateway using the Rogers Xfinity app. Let's go. Before we begin, open your equipment kit. It includes everything you'll need to get set up. Next, open your Rogers Xfinity app and sign in using your My Rogers username and password. To start, select Get Started. If the Get Started screen doesn't appear when you've signed in, select the account icon. Under Devices, select Activate Rogers Xfinity Gateway. Follow the app's on-screen instructions to identify your gateway next. Find a central spot where you can connect the gateway to a cable outlet. It's best to have it raised on a shelf or table. Also, consider where you'll use Wi-Fi the most, especially for streaming videos. Connect the gateway to a cable outlet and an electrical outlet using the coax cable coax connector, if needed, and power cord or adapter provided. Avoid using electrical outlets controlled by a dimmer or wall switch. Make sure the connections to your gateway and to the outlets are tight and secure. Once your gateway is plugged in, the app will test its connection. Within five minutes, the light on your gateway should flash and turn orange, then green, then turn either solid or blinking white. An alternating orange-green flashing light means the gateway software is updating. This can take up to 20 minutes. If the light doesn't turn white, try another cable outlet, keeping in mind the placement tips from earlier. Next, enter a Wi-Fi network name and a password you'll remember. You can set the same name and password you use today to keep your current devices connected without interruption. Once done, select Confirm and Finish Up. The app will finish setting up your new Wi-Fi network. This can take up to 10 minutes. Do not unplug your gateway during this time. To help keep the Wi-Fi signal strong, attach terminating caps on all unused cable wall outlets and splitters in your home. That's it. Your gateway is set up. You can start enjoying strong, secure Wi-Fi throughout your home.